Hey guys, it's Dana, and I'm back to explain to you what is the Dream 100 strategy. So, uh, in case you don't know what the Dream 100 is, or you're familiar, or kind of familiar, and just want to know more about it, this video is going to be for you. So, uh, my journey in Dream 100 began several years ago when I read a book called The Ultimate Sales Machine by a guy named Chet Holmes. And inside that book, there was a chapter on the Dream 100, and that to me was amazing. Okay, so I scoured everywhere I could find books, courses, you name it. For more information on the Dream 100, it was something that I was always doing, but I didn't know there was a name for it. Um, and I couldn't find hardly anything. So I kind of planted my flag as the Dream 100 guy um, and since have created sort of a Dream 100 empire. Um, and now I'm, I'm looking to, uh, you know, communicate and champion the Dream 100 even more. So here is the Dream 100 strategy um, according to me. So um, the easiest way to tell you what Dream 100 is in the Dream 100 strategy is, um, is to begin with telling you what it's not. So there's a lot of misconceptions around the Dream 100, unfortunately. Um, and one of them is, is just sending people gifts. That's not the Dream 100. Like that's a tiny little piece of it, scratching the surface of it, but that's not the, the entire Dream 100, okay? So I've got a friend of mine named Russell Brunson who um, is a co-founder for a company called ClickFunnels and he's grown that thing massively um, on the back of the Dream 100 using the Dream 100 strategy. So he actually um, quoted uh, in my book, Dream 100 book, uh, he said that, the Dream 100 is the foundation uh, for his entire company, okay? So it's not sending gifts. It's not just getting traffic. It's a bigger picture than that. It's a foundation, okay? So what it really is in the simplest way possible is a value exchange between you and others that you intentionally seek out to ed, you know, level up each other, okay? So I'll explain kind of um, Chet's version of the Dream 100 and how he used it. Um, Dream Hunter strategy, and then I will explain um, other people and how they use the Dream Hunter strategy. So Chet decided to go after a hundred different um, uh, different magazines that he could sell advertising to. Okay, and he relentlessly pursued them for six months. And you can read his story in his book, Ultimate Sales Machine. So he went what I call the one to one approach. Okay, so since I've kind of um, evolved this concept into more than that. I've watched um, a friend of mine I mentioned before, Russell Brunson. He has taken Chet's kind of approach. And instead of going after his end clients or customers to try to sell directly to them, he used the Dream 100 strategy to go after his end affiliates. Okay. So he wanted to go and acquire affiliates to sell his software. And so Russell created a Dream 100 um, list and strategy to go and go out and um, create relationships based on value with his affiliates. And he very quickly uh, blew up his company in doing so. So it's much more than just sending gifts. Um, it's just know that the foundation of this is built on value. Okay. So it's a constant value exchange that never ends. All right. It should never end. It should begin small, probably just like, you know, any relationship, but then it should evolve and it should end up into some, you know, the equivalent of a marriage, right? So it's not a one-off thing. Hey, can I JV with you? And then if you say, no, I, I'm going to be, think you're a jerk and then never want to work with you. No, it's not sending a gift and expecting all these things and conditions attached to it. Um, and if you don't get your way, you just, you know, you, you, you hate the person. No, that's not the Dream 100, okay? The Dream 100 is a value exchange. Um, in a relationship that is never ending that you build with um, your Dream 100 um, targets, whoever they may be. You can go one-to-one -one just like Chet did if you have an offer or, or you know you sell something that's worth quite a bit, makes sense to do it that way. You can go one-to-many like Russell, myself, and many others have to create referral sources um, or you know whatever is valuable to you. You create your own network um, of contractors, et cetera. Just the Dream 100 strategy encompasses everything. And the, the sooner you get that kind of um, you understand that and you can kind of intentionally start using Dream 100 strategy for your benefit, the sooner you're going to notice a ton of growth and opportunity um, presenting itself. So with that being said, if you like this, you dig this stuff, go ahead and click the subscribe button, comment below. I'd love to hear it, see and read your comments. Um, go ahead and grab the Dream 100 book. If you don't have a copy of it, link will be in the description. Um, and then if you're ready to rock and roll and go deep on the Dream 100, um, you're going to want to become a Dream 100 member. So uh, the link will be in the description for that as well. Uh, otherwise, you're the best. Appreciate you very much.